There's a case of the deadly coronavirus in the United States. But should we be worried? A whole And we are following breaking news right now here on HQ. Reports from an IOC member that the 2020 Tokyo Olympics will be postponed until next year. Thank you. Also developing right now, Governor Greg Abbott announcing new quarantine orders for people flying to Texas from coronavirus hot. Now more than 30 school districts across our area have announced additional closings on top of spring break. Okay, the school year is almost over. We know thousands of seniors are unsure if they're going to get a real graduation. Well, today, ABC 13's Pooja Lodi is celebrating, and uh, it was some students here who got a special cap and gown parade. Hey, Pooja. Hey, Eric, you know, it is all about making the best of a tough situation. That is what we are doing right here in the Fifth Ward. Take a look as you are watching live Seniors are coming through right here at Yes Prep in the 5th Ward. They are receiving their caps and gowns. They're getting all kinds of fun out here, really celebrating their graduation and all of their hard work. And now they always say congratulations. Worked so hard, forgot how to vacation. They ain't never had the dedication. People hating, say we changing, look, we made it. Yeah. That was never friendly, yeah Now I'm jumping out of band, yeah And I know I sound dramatic, yeah But I know I had to have it, yeah For the money, I'm a savage, yeah I be itching like I had it, yeah I'm surrounded 20 bags, yeah But they didn't know me last year, yeah My mama called, see you on TV Sunset done change Ever since we was on, I dreamed it all Ever since I was young, they said I won't be nothing Now they always say congratulations Worked so hard, forgot how to vacation They ain't never had the dedication People hating, say we changing, look, we made it Yeah, we made it It's a first generation case, like almost all of them are first gen So their parents haven't seen them walk through the stage And they haven't done it themselves And when they all look back on this strange year Students and their parents will always remember what it feels like to have a family so big they take up the whole parking lot. Hello, my name is Mark DeBella and I am the CEO of Yes Prep Public Schools. And in 1994, I attended William & Mary in Virginia. On behalf of the entire Yes Prep community, it is my honor to welcome you to our annual Senior Signing Day. For almost 20 years now, we've used Senior Signing Day as our way to gather the entire Yes Prep community to celebrate our seniors. And this year, unfortunately, we cannot physically gather. And we grieve that loss. We grieve the loss of the world that we knew. We grieve the loss of the health and lives of so many. And we grieve the loss of the experiences that we longed for that have been taken for, from us. Yet as members of the Yes Prep family, we prove time and time again that we refuse to let loss define us. In fact, in the face of obstacles and the hardest time in the history of our school system, against all odds, we will persist and we will thrive. It's what we do, it's who we are. Seniors, next I wanna speak directly to you. I am deeply sorry that a day that some of you have been waiting for for your entire 
careers at Yes Prep, some of you since the time you joined us as sixth graders has been taken from you. It's not fair, it's not right, and against all odds though, you still persist. It's what you do, it's who you are. Last week I was able to make it to almost all of the senior cap and gown pickup parades and I saw many of you there. And over and over again, I saw in your faces two resounding emotions, joy and resolve. Joy in seeing your friends and teachers after so long and resolve that you would not let loss define you. So let's carry those emotions, joy and resolve into our virtual senior signing day tonight. Seniors, though today is not as we'd planned it to be, today we joyfully and we resolvedly celebrate all 1,443 of you. Senior wizards, trailblazers, mavericks, explorers, the force, legends, cavaliers, marvels, titans, pride, raiders, and this year for the first time ever, Eisenhower Eagles and White Oak Owls, we are here to celebrate you. You earned it. Next to the parents and family members of the seniors, thank you so much for trusting us with the responsibility of educating your children. And I am truly sorry that we are not able to do this in person to celebrate your hard work over the years because you too earned it. There are now 14,000 Yes Prep students across our 19 campuses including sixth graders from our newest school, Yes Prep Hobby. To all of the Yes Prep students out there, thank you for your hard work this year, especially over the challenging last two months where you have kept Yes Prep learning. Thank you all for joining us to celebrate the accomplishments of our seniors and their accomplishments are indeed great. Seniors, over 90% of you are first generation college bound. And when you go to college this fall, we'll have close to 8,000 Yes Prep alumni who've earned or who are actively pursuing their college degrees. Seniors, this year you submitted 13,264 applications and you earned 7,141 acceptances. You earned millions and millions of dollars in scholarships and 11 of you received the prestigious Dream US Scholarship. To all the dreamers, we value you, we celebrate you, and we continue to dream with you. Seniors, some of you have chosen to serve our country in the armed forces. My brother is a Marine, and I'm deeply grateful for the path of service that you have chosen. We are proud of you. Seniors, some of you have chosen to pursue a course other than college. I want you to know that regardless of the path that you take after you leave us, you will always be a part of the Yes Prep family and we will always be proud of you. Seniors, I'd like to close right now with a charge to you specifically. Though you may feel lost right now and that is totally natural, I encourage you to dig deep and find the resolve to persist. For many years, I was a marathon runner and I found this quote particularly inspiring when I was a runner. At mile 20, I thought I was dead. At mile 22, I wished I was dead. At mile 24, I knew I was dead. But at mile 26.2, against all odds, I realized I had become too tough to kill. Seniors having become the very first graduating class in over a century to live through a global pandemic, you have become tough, tougher than even the toughest marathon runner. And I want you to use that toughness to never accept loss as final, to believe that your best years are most certainly in front of you and to relentlessly pursue your dreams of creating a more just country, one that will recognize your greatness because you will demand that of it. I am proud to have served as your superintendent when you were with us, and I'm even prouder of all that you will accomplish when you leave. Seniors from the bottom of my heart, thank you for all that you have given to Yes Prep over the years. I wish I could have been with you live in person to celebrate. Hopefully we'll get to celebrate together later in the summer at in-person graduation. In the meantime, I wish you all the best in your endeavors. You will persist, you will thrive. It's what you do, it's who you are. Have a great night, you've earned it.
Vosotros estaremos empezando en el otoño. We will rather like just like you. We hope you come to our big day. Please. Make sure to save the date. Pero vamos a cerca de ustedes. Well done, two missions. From the class of 2033. Attending Lycoming College. Go Future Warriors, Lyco 2024. My name is Colin Zajiman and I go to Yes Prep Brazos. This fall, I'll be attending Vanderbilt University. Before I announce the college I'll be attending, I would like to give a quick shout out to Ms. Gounder, Ms. Watson, Mr. Nunez, and Ms. Bernardo. You have been there for me since the beginning and I really appreciate it. Now, Adriana Magarin will be attending University of Houston downtown for 2024. <laughs> Hello, my name is C. Burr, and this fall I'll be attending Houston Community College. And I want to thank my teachers for supporting me through these rough times and my parents for pushing me not to give up on my dreams. Thank you. Hola, soy Roxana Arevalo y en el otoño voy a ir a la Universidad Baptista de Houston. Go Huskies! Hi, my name is Guadalupe Zaragoza, and this fall I will be attending Houston Baptist University. My name is Jesus Tamayo, and my chosen path is to enlist in the United States Marine Corps. Hello, I am Ramses Morales, and I come here to present to you that I, from Yes Prep East End, am going to 
for University of Houston downtown. Hi, my name is Kevin Quintana from Yes Prep B Stand, and this fall I will be attending Texas A&M University. <laughs> And this fall, I will be attending the University of Texas at Denver! My name is Natalie Medina, and this year I'll be attending TSU. I'll be graduating in 2024. Yes! What's up, y'all? It's Ozzy. In this 2020 school year, I'll be scoring some grand slams at San Jack. Hello, everybody. My name is Paul Cruz, and this fall, I will be attending Emory University! <laughs> Woo! Go Eagles! Hello, my name is Coraima Soyo, and in 2024, I'll be graduating from Texas a and Corpus Christi. Yay! <laughs> my name is Nelly Garcia, and this fall, I'll be attending Kobe College! <laughs> Hi, my name is Karen Castrejon, and this fall, I am attending the College of Healthcare Profession. My name is Stephanie Lacan, and this fall, I'm going to be attending University of Houston downtown. Yay! Yay! Howdy, my name is Kathleen Gutierrez and this fall I'll be the newest, loudest, and proudest member of the Fighting Texas Aggies. Giga! How you guys doing? My name is Kevon Little of Yes Prep Eisenhower and this fall I will be attending Texas State University! Woo! Hi, my name is Amy Aguilas, and I just wanted to give a big thank you out to my friends, families, and teachers in helping me to announce that this fall, I will be attending Louisiana State University! Woo! I'm Jemiah. What? And Tangier Hi, beautiful, sassy. What? Going to Peep. What you say? What? I'm going to Peep. What you say? Peep. You, you know? know. Number two, number two, number two. My name is Ashley Hernandez, and this summer I will be leaving to boot camp for the United States Marine Corps. Hello, <laughs> so guys, my name is Jorge Sandoval, and this fall I'll be attending the University of St. Thomas. Shout out to my mom and dad and my family for this, bro. Hi, I'm Leslie, and this fall I'll be attending the University of Houston main campus. Go Cougs! I'm Nadale Castillo, and I'll be graduating from Texas A&M. Yay! Hey, y'all, my name is Marlon Salinas. And thanks to the Dream.us National Scholarship, this fall I'll be attending A&M San Antonio. Hello, my name is Asana Alderette and I'll be joining the United States Navy. Hi. My name is Pedro Balcazar. And this fall, I will be attending Stephen F. Austin University. Let's go. My name is Johnny Guerrero from Yes Prep North Central. And this fall, I'll be attending Rice University. I'm Ruben Carbajal. I go to Yes Prep North Central and I'll be attending Boston University. I'd like to thank my family, my friends, and my teachers for helping me get this far. Hi, my name is Jasmine Diaz and this fall, I'll be attending Pope College. I'll be attending the University of Houston. Hi, my name is Juan Jimenez. If you wonder where I'm at, I'm on my roof. Because wherever I'm at, I'm always going to be on top. <laughs> okay, setting that aside, I do want to say how much I appreciate my family, my teachers, my homeboys, and my homegirls. Because without them, I wouldn't be able to say that I'm going to Boston University. Hi, I'm Kimana, and I'm going to University of Houston. My name is Jorge Ernesto de Agoscobar, and in 2024, I will be graduating from the University of Houston downtown. Yay! Yay! Hi, my name is Iceland Perez, and this fall, I'll be attending the University of North Texas. <laughs> Hello, my name is Alexa Marquez, and in 2024, I will graduate from University of Houston. My name is Samira Martinez, and thanks to my family, I will be attending George Washington University! 
Hi, my name is Victor Tamayo, and in the fall of 2020, I'll be attending Baylor University. My name is Leah Longoria, and I'm going to St. Edwards University! <laughs> Hi, my name is Charles Luz, and in the fall of 2020, I will become an Eagle. So, University of North Texas, I'm coming on. My name is Betabe Jimenez Ortiz, and I will be attending the University of Houston downtown. Hello, my name is Gracia Lopez, and this fall I'll be attending at Houston Community College. Woo! <laughs> Hi, my name is Ayana McGraw, and this fall I'll be attending <laughs> University of Houston. Hi, this is Ashari Baptiste. I am a senior at White Oak, and I just wanted to let you guys know that I will be attending University of Texas at San Antonio this fall. Hi, my name is Jasmine, and this fall I will be attending University of Texas. Hi, my name is Karen Overa, and in 2024, I will be graduating from nearing the finish line of our virtual senior signing day and we would like to take an opportunity to recognize an individual from each campus. Stay tuned to hear who is representing the values of your campus. Each student has earned their spot at the college of their choice. My name is Nella Garcia Urban and I am the Chief Program Officer here at Yes Prep. My name is Philip Wright and I am the Chief Schools Officer at Yes Prep. At Yes Prep West, we want to recognize Yi Hong Sun who is the class salutatorian, scored an incredibly high 1550 on his SAT and received many accolades as a QuestBridge and AP scholar. He's participated in sports, orchestra, and a leader in the National Honor Society. Johns Hopkins University, you've got a great one. Congratulations, Ihong. At North Central, Mariana Chavez. Mariana is an academic juggernaut, a staunch self-advocate and a student who accomplishes each task placed in front of her. In addition to winning numerous awards while at North Central, she is involved in the Women's Empowerment Club and Cross Country. Duke University, get ready for Mariana. At Yes Prep Golfton, Natalie Garcia is the class valedictorian, traveled to South Korea during one of her summer opportunities, and this dancer cheerleader was named as a prestigious posse scholar. Congratulations, Natalie, who's headed to Colby College. At Eisenhower High School, Jemiah Lane. During her time at Eisenhower, Jemiah served as an athletic trainer, athletic videographer, and was also highly involved in the student council. She also took and passed every single AP course offered at Eisenhower. In addition to her academic accolades, she choreographed the Black History Program all four years. Prairie View a and get ready for Jemiah. At Yes Prep North Forest, Alfredo Bermudez Rivera is recognized for his hard work and persistence. This athlete and summer counselor and mentor to younger students is going to do a fantastic job at Lamar University. Best of luck and thank you for your time at the Forest, Alfredo. At Braze Oaks, Jolibet Alvarado. Jolibet, or Jolly as she is known on campus, has served in multiple roles as an athletic manager, trainer, and athlete during her time at Braze Oaks. She also has received over $62,000 in renewable scholarships as she prepares to enter her college career. Jolly, we cannot wait to see what you accomplish at the University of Virginia. Way to go. At Yes Prep Northside, we want to recognize Mylene Lainez. This Onolurenia is known for her take charge attitude, academic excellence, kindness, and dedication. She's been a member of student council, led student ambassadors, and played basketball throughout her time at Yes Prep. Congratulations, Mylin, and best of luck at Rhodes College. At Fifth Ward, Victor Garcia Mosqueda. Victor is an outstanding student leader, a member of student council, and a captain of the cross country team at Fifth Ward. He has received multiple full financial aid packages, including from Impact Partners. 
Victor aspires to be an aerospace engineering major, and we hope to see you back in Houston at NASA in the future. Purdue University, get ready for Victor. For the founding class of Yes Prep White Oak, Alvaro Jaimes. We're so sad that we didn't get to see Alvaro light up the stage this year as a member and founding captain of the White Oak dance team. Alvaro is a leader, part of student council, and the Pride Alliance. Alvaro, best of luck at St. John's University. We'll miss you. At East End, Aldaid Rincon Zavala. Aldaid is an exceptional student who has defied the odds. He moved to the United States from Mexico with the goal of going to college and becoming a doctor. Through hard work and persistence, he quickly rose to the top of his class and is now going to college as an impact scholar. Aldaid, we cannot wait to see what you accomplish at George Washington University. For Yas Prep Northbrook High School, Sara Reyes. Sara is known for being an incredible senior student, but thriving throughout her entire time at Yas Prep Northbrook. She's an excellent student, scoring perfect scores on multiple AP exams, but also participated in debate, basketball, and exemplifying the Yes Prep commitment to service as a volunteer at the Houston Food Bank. Congratulations and best of luck at Washington and Jefferson College in Pennsylvania. At Southwest, Jesus Portales. Jesus is the definition of a humble leader. In addition to serving his community throughout his time at Southwest, he ended his high school career by being the class body president his senior year. During this time, he was an advocate for his classmates and created new senior traditions and privileges that will last at Southwest long after he leaves. Northwestern University, get ready for Jesus. At Yes Prep Southeast, Fabian Luna. Fabian is known as a natural born leader. He's an athlete on the varsity soccer team, has participated in National Honor Society, coordinated student ambassadors, and been a leader in the National Hispanic Institute. Fabian is the class valedictorian and holds the record for the highest SAT score on campus. Stanford University, you are lucky to have Fabian Luna. Congratulations. Class of 2020. Hi there, my name is Sheryl Reyes and I will be attending University of Houston main campus. I swear, it's a cougar, not a bear. Hey, my name is Nate Chavez, I go to Yes Prep North Central and I will be going to the University of Houston downtown. Action. My name is Mauro Moreno. I go to Yes Prep North Central and I'll be attending Texas State Technical College. Okay, let me just set my phone real quick. My name is Kara Pichas. I'm going to the University of North Texas. I'm Andres Salas and I'm soon going to be a graduate from Lamar University. Hello, my name is Judith and CISO, and this fall I will be attending the University of Texas at Dallas. <laughs> Hello, my name is Solo Figueroa, and I'm a senior Southwest. Next year, I will give me Harvard, I mean Lamar University. We're seniors in Yesterday of Southwest, and I'm Miguel Lopanco. My name is Emilio Hurtado. I'm David Guerrero, and we're going, we're going to, to the University, University of Houston main campus. campus. What's poppin'? Jason Renato Solis here, through to announce that this fall, I will be attending Louisiana State University. So from now on, you can refer to me as Jason Exotic. Louisiana's new Tiger King. Go Tigers! I saw Tiger. 
My name is Mark Cardenas and I commit to United States Air Force. Happy birthday, Gigi. Rest in peace. Oh, let's go!